Previously on Soma. And now. Yeah, that's terrifying sounds there too. Reminder, okay, so this is an airlock as well. You know, you've got no head, so you can't tell me anything. Well, I'm gonna have to go back in there and find a battery pack. That's for sure. Don't know where that thing is. Not there. Uh, I mean, we could look in storage, I guess. Guess this is a place we could maybe hide as well. Just some physics enabled objects in here, it seems. Okay. So let's see if we can sneak back in here. Can't go there. That's a crawl space. Our favorite place to go. What's over here? Just kind of a little hidey corner. Sorry, dude. I don't see the thing anymore. I hear it, though. It's still right there, is it? Well... What am I supposed to do? Trigger it to chase me? And then come back around and grab whatever's in that cabinet? Maybe I could throw something and get it to go after something. Well, I mean, that got its attention, but it didn't move. Still didn't move. Okay then. You're just gonna stand there crying, are you? Well, um let's see if we can sneak behind you then. Maybe you won't notice us this time. I mean we're not gonna hurt you or anything. Okay, so that was, that was not the way to go about it. Don't know where you're at. Don't really care. Oh, hello. Yeah, me too. I just, you know, I feel like screaming every once in a while as well, but... You know, you gotta go on about what you're doing and just get the job done. Nobody really cares about what you're going through. I know this for a fact. I don't know what you just said, Ross, but I'll watch it on playback when I process this video. And try to figure out what's going down. Whew. Okay, so we're damaged now. And... Guess we're back in here. Guess I better heal myself. Maybe the WoW won't send more junk after me. Yeah. Alright. Guess we go down to the bottom floor for the final piece. Oh, hello Ross. I'm trying to help. Please don't kill me. I'm one piece away from being able to actually do something, okay? 
I mean, I know you don't know that I'm telling the truth, but I promise I am. If I can remember how to get back downstairs. Okay, this is to where Catherine's at, plugged in. Alright. And we came from this side and then to the left. Yeah, okay. Good deal. So we need a cortex chip still. And that should be the last piece if I remember correctly. So we can, well we were in here. Can we unlock down here now? Yes, please override the lockdown. All right. And what horrible monstrosity is going to be down here waiting for us, eh? Looks like there's only one way to go. Yeah, I'm doing it, okay? Maybe you should take out these things that are trying to prevent me instead of bugging me all the time. Uh, there's somebody still alive with a head still. And that's not at all horrible or anything. Locked drawers. Why y'all gotta lock all your drawers? Of course, I'm kind of grateful for it if there's nothing in there. Okay. Just more physics-enabled objects. Thought I saw something dash across the floor there. Probably something I dropped. Or maybe it was a shadow? This thing? Core chip, text chip, diagnostics. Uh, eject? No? Hmm. What am I... Oh! What am I trying to do? Okay... So that connects comms, maybe? Or maybe this, maybe they all need to come down to here as well. Huh. Over to here. Takes it down. That? No. Oh no, there's no connection, but well, there is a connection there. Uh, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing on this one. Okay. Worker, is there some kind of diagram to explain this to me? No. Okay then. Eject. Eject that chip. It, spit it out. Let it go. Do the thing. Oh! Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Huh. Is this, am I trying to get it to go over here or, I, I don't really know. Let's try. Okay. Hello? 
Okay, so that's not what I'm supposed to be doing. Go back to sleep. Okay, let's try this. Okay, so it's the it's the blank one that that dictates the flow. Then, I gotcha. Okay, so like that, like that. Yes. Okay, so it took a minute, but we figured it out. Cortex chip. Nice. I think that was all that we needed, but there is stuff down here to look at still, I believe. Like, uh, this android. This is not a dude. This is an and dude, android dude. It's a robot. A very human looking robot. Another hand exerciser. Haven't seen one of those in a long time. Lots of audio logs. What's up? Uh, yeah, I know you suffer. Day. I'm trying to help, I, I promise. I might not be around for a few days, okay? Rally her relieving the listening post? Must be important. It is, Strask. It is. Oh, she went to find Alpha. Okay, then. Stay safe. Okay, wait, that was the last one. I should have listened to them in order. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Okay. Please respond. I'm going to stop it, I promise. You just gotta give me time. Please respond, Tau. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Omicron, can you hear us? Loud and clear. Everyone alright? We will be as soon as we make friends with the power suits. I'm sure you'll get used to it. <laughs> yeah, I, I get it. Okay, so apparently, is that guy gone? No, he's still there. Thought the android had got up and left. Anything else to find? Oh, there's lots of stuff to look at. Into the abyss. Take it to Alpha in the abyss. No, it's it's sick. Alpha needs medicine. Alpha. So, I'm drawing lots of triangles with red dots in the mid in the center. Find Tau. Find Alpha. Take the jail to Alpha. Ah, the wow! Once more structure structure jail. The heart of Alpha. Yep. All right. Well, let's see if we can get back up there and. You just stay there, okay? Probably going to get accosted on our way up there. Seems like the thing that would happen. Okay, let's go. Oh, there's a save. So something has changed, which I know we found the last piece, but something's going down because it's saving. We have probably got a risk of dying. Uh... Hello, Ross. I'm doing it, I promise. Oh, okay. Good deal, then. I mean, just don't hurt me. Take care of that thing, will you? Shut the door, Cap. Lock it up. What's happening? Lock the door. It's locked! There's a thing, okay? I managed to piss off another one of WoW's monsters. We have everything we need, right? Yeah. Let's get to work. 
Okay, where do I do this? On this thing? Uh, yeah. Oh, great. <laughs> this is crazy. Don't worry, it'll work. I got a Johnny Five head from Short Circuit. Yeah, I guess I just pour sure this. All bunched together with the structure jam connecting all the parts. Yeah. All right, try activating the seat from the terminal again. And I guess I gotta go in there and transfer myself into it. Is that the deal? Activate D. Look at all those gibberish. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was gonna suggest that if you refused. You'd go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it, change body. Yes, if you want to stay here, I'm not going to stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. Will it be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Okay, is there going to be bad stuff going on in the meantime? I need to plug it in or something. Some precision wrenches or screwdrivers. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. Okay. You lost me halfway there. You don't really need to understand it. Just make them line up. Okay. Okay, that's too fast, I guess. Which one am I changing? I'm changing the solid line, it looks like. That's close. It's closer. Getting there. Ah, there we go. Good deal. Uh, lock. That's everything. You can climb into the pilot seat now. Already? All right. I have everything under control, so please have a seat. <sighs> Don't kill me, Catherine, please. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. Uh huh. It's like having your picture taken. Uh, with the most expensive camera in the world. <laughs> You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. <laughs> it's a nice little call back there. Off we go. Yeah. There must be something wrong. Can't you run a diagnosis or something? Oh, we're a copy. No, I, it's just... Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied. And now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn you, Kath. Two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in his fucking nightmare again? All alone? So cruel. 
Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? Yeah. What if, what if he didn't need to wake up? You'd do that? I don't know. Maybe. There. I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in anymore. I mean, I don't know which is worse. I don't really... Hello, previous Simon, who we've been playing as almost this entire game. And now we're a copy. Just like you were a copy of the original organic Simon. I don't know how you'll feel about being left alone. There's monstrous things wandering around this station. I think if it were me, I'd want a chance to try to survive. I mean, who knows? Maybe we can get back here and get you after we deal with the WoW. So, I don't think I can kill you. I think, think that'll be up to you when you wake up, how you want to go about your life. Yeah, but that just goes on about my point about the continuity thing just being a bunch of BS. <sighs> Man, that just feels so weird. I guess we're off into the abyss now. Sorry about the long period of silence there. I'm just kind of really introspective at the moment. It makes you feel really funny experiencing, you know, the story of this game. And to me, that's when I know that something has a real impact. It just goes down into the abyss there. So let's look at this other place really quick. Yeah, I mean, man, make you, it'll make you think. That's for sure. About the nature of what it actually means to be human and be a sentient life form. I don't know. I mean, we've always used sort of the definition that sentience means being aware of your own mortality and of what's going on around you and understanding beyond a merely instinctual level. By that definition, then these consciousnesses that are being created in this game are alive. Are we done here? Yeah. Activate the clamor, please. Sure thing. All right. So, what do I push to make it start? This. Take a seat and we'll be off. All right, Catherine. I can tell you're not feeling too good about this either. It's like an amusement park ride. The tower drop thing. Journey, the full journey. 
He wouldn't understand. How could he? I couldn't do it, and you knew it. You were right in trying to hide him from me. I only wish you'd done a better job. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist's brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? I'd still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends? I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have... So something goes wrong again. Catherine? Kath? Hello, Catherine. What happened? I don't know if you noticed, but the passenger thing there, I said it to one because there's only one of us with a physical body, but it changed itself to two. I thought that was interesting. No power. It won't let me take the, the Omni tool. Wow. Look at the bioluminescent creatures out there. Are we still descending? Because it looks like those are going up. Looks like they're all going up. I don't have... I mean, I can sit down. Do I need to do something with this? No. Don't I have the option to interact with these? No. Oh, I guess I... Can I not... Why can I not take the Omni tool? It's just not an option. I guess we go up and out. <laughs> <laughs> 